Hello everyone and welcome to your 15 minute inner and outer thigh pilates workout. In today's session you guys are not going to need any equipment, just some space to perform the exercises and a soft surface. We are going to be working timer based as well so 45 seconds on each exercise, 15 seconds recovery. So guys when you're ready let's get started. We are gonna start with our wide squat. Just take those feet out nice and wide, toes pointed out to each corner of your mat, rotating those knees out in line with the pinky toe. We tuck the tailbone under, we drop the knees down, press those knees out. Inhale, we lift. Exhale, lower the hips directly down, knees pressing out towards that little toe. Inhale up, exhale lower. Breathe in and out. This whole time you want to be tucking that tailbone under and drawing your belly button in towards your spine. Just warming up the legs with this exercise. Inhale lower, exhale press from those heels, lift up, squeeze the butt cheeks. Next exercise, we're going to add on a pulse. 15 seconds, shake it off. Tucking that tailbone under, we add in the pulse, so lower all the way down, up an inch, down an inch, all the way up. Ready? Let's go, guys. Inhale, lower, inch, up. So we add that pulse, lower, pulse, and lift. Keeping that chest lifted, shoulders down, pressed away from your ears. Inhale and exhale, lift. Just 15 more seconds. Try and get a little bit lower. Keeping those knees out. You got three, two, one. Let's make our way down onto the floor. So we've got our low plank leg lifts. So elbow under your shoulder, knees on the mat, lift, use your obliques, top leg is completely straight. We're gonna lift and lower. Lift and lower that top leg. In our side plank, make sure your chest lifted, shoulders are stacked and our hips are stacked. So we're in a nice straight line. Making sure you're not lowering down here, lift those shoulders, lift the chest. Your leg is lifting directly to the side as well. Keep tensing those abs. You guys have got 10 more seconds. Keep going. Inhale lower, exhale lift. Coming all the way onto the floor, we're gonna go into our clams. So extend your arm long, relax your head down, stack those hips. Knees are bent forwards, feet are back in line with your hips. We're tensing those abs. Inhale, exhale, we open the knee. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, we open. So with this exercise, again, hips are stacked forwards. And as we open the knee, we keep them forwards, we don't rock backwards. Your hand can be in front for support, whatever you like. Inhale, lower down, exhale, lift. Make sure you're keeping those heels together the whole time. Inhale, exhale. Next up, we've got clams too. So keep your knees where they are, but we're gonna lift your feet up off the floor. Ready guys, in five seconds, we're gonna open and close the knee. So hips are forwards, your abs are tense, drawing that belly button into your spine. 
your feet are staying together the whole time and your hips stay forwards. We don't rock backwards like this. We open the knee directly over the bottom knee. Inhale, lower. Exhale, we lift. Inhale, we lower. Exhale, we lift. Awesome work, guys. Squeeze that heel as you open your knee. You guys are doing amazing. Next, we've got a leg circle. So lower that leg down underneath and you extend your top leg, making some tiny circles forwards. Ready, guys? We've got five seconds. Let's go extend that top leg and take those tiny circles forwards. I like to call these the rings of fire, the circles of fire, because they burn. <laughs> so with this exercise, you're just breathing naturally. Nice deep breaths. Inhale and exhale. It's all about control with this one, keeping the top half of your body as still as possible. Checking your leg, making sure that it is in line with your hips and your foot is circling just a little bit above your hip height. Well done guys. Oh, punch out that glute if you need to. Next we've got inner thighs. So fold your top leg over, extend that bottom leg. We're inhaling here. As you exhale, you lift that leg underneath. So using your inner thigh of the leg underneath, we lift and lower. What I like about this is the top glute gets a bit of a stretch. Really try and aim your leg up towards the sky. Make sure you're lifting directly up so the inside of your thigh faces the sky. Keep tensing your abs. Try and lift as high as you can. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Really work that inner thigh to lift it up a little bit higher. You've got this. Next, we are going to extend both of our legs. You're gonna lift the top leg, hold it here, feel the burn, and then we're gonna lift and lower the leg underneath. Ready guys? Three, two, one, let's go. So we're working the outer thigh and your glute here, as well as the inner thigh of the lower leg. You guys are doing amazing. This is the final one before we're gonna turn over to the other side. Keep going, keep lifting that top leg, don't let it drop. You've got this guys, use your inner thigh, lift and lift. Inhale, exhale, you can do this. Well done. Now we're going to swap over to the other side. So first of all, we've got that low plank leg lifts. So bottom knees on the floor, hips are stacked, shoulders are stacked. Use those obliques. We're going to be lifting and lowering that top leg. Again, your chest is lifted, shoulders down away from your ears. Your body is in a straight line. We're using those obliques to keep those hips stacked. And then we're using that top glute to lift and lower your leg. You guys got this. Inhale and exhale. You'll probably feel that bottom glute working too. Final 10 seconds. You can do this. Inhale, lower. exhale, lift. Two, last one, we lower all the way down and we're gonna go into our clams. So arm long, head resting down. Hips are stacked one on top of each other. Feet back in line with your hips. Hips are stacked. Take a big inhale. As you exhale, we open that top knee. Inhale, low down. Exhale, we open. So again, we keep those hips stacked. 
and our top knee lifts above that bottom knee. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Make sure we're squeezing those heels together as you open your knee. And then abs are on. We keep tensing the abs the whole time. 10 more seconds. Well done guys. Next up we've got the clams too. So same movement, but we lift our feet, knees, the bottom knee stays on the floor. And then we open and close that top knee. Ready guys? Three, two, one. Let's go. So same movement, knee opens and closes. We keep those hips forwards and heels together. You can always take a look at your positioning, making sure it's correct. And then relax that head back down because we want our spine to stay straight. Last 15 seconds here. Keep squeezing that heel as you lift your knee. Open, inhale, exhale. Well done guys, relax your legs down now. We extend that top leg, lift it up so it's a bit above your hip height and then we take those tiny circles forwards. Those rings of fire. Ready guys? Let's go. Tiny circles forwards. So again, control the movement and breathe naturally. Make sure those abs are on and we're keeping the top half of our body nice and still. All the movement is coming from those hips to make those tiny circles. Again, the side of your leg wants to be facing the sky. So hips are stacked one on top of each other, making sure it's really important so we use the correct muscles. Three, two, one, we give that top glute a bit of a break. We fold your leg over, extend the leg underneath. Make sure your inner thigh is facing the sky before we lift and lower. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. We lift and lower that leg underneath. So really focus on your inner thigh muscles, lifting your leg. Aiming that foot up as high as you can each time. Breathe in as you go down, use the breath, exhale and we'll lift. Don't forget, tense the abs. Inhale, exhale. Beautiful work guys. You're doing amazing. Four more seconds. Well done, so now the top leg lifts, our body is in one straight line. We lift that top leg so it's above the hip height and then we're gonna lift and lower that leg underneath. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Lower and then we lift. So you wanna keep that top leg lifted the whole time. And then the bottom leg lifts up to reach that top foot. Hands in front for support. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Don't let that top leg drop. Keep it lifted. Inhale and exhale. You guys are doing incredible. Five more seconds left. Well done, this is our final exercise. We've got our T rotations with our leg lift. So come into your plank position, we rotate to the side, hold here, we lift, and then we lower, and then we're gonna rotate to the other side. Stack those shoulders, stack those hips, we lift and we lower. This is our final exercise now. You've got this. 
Control is key. Lift, stack, lift and lower. Keep those hips in line. You can do this. Inhale, exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, coming round. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, lift the leg. Inhale, lower. Exhale, back round to your plank position. Well done, guys. Coming down now, let's sit back in child's pose. Extend those arms, let those hips sink to your feet. And then when you're ready, rolling up. Well done, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today for your 15 minute Pilates class. Hope you guys enjoyed today's session. If you are, the best way to support this channel is hit that like button, hit subscribe, and I'll see you all again in our next session.